Fanixies, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm gonna make another photo frame. And if you are wondering another, then yes, I've already made one on my channel previously. So you can go and check that out. And this is the second one. So without any further ado, let's get on into the video. Alright, to start with, first I'm gonna take this brown cardboard and then I'll just take a photo and just I'll just take the measurements and cut it out. So once it's done, as you can see, this is how it looks. So this will be the design for the photo frame. Now I'll take this beautiful lemon yellow, pastel yellow colored paper and I'll just cover this cardboard with this card paper. So for that I'm just using my cutter and I'll just make a plus sign over here. And then I'll just cut it off. Okay, so cutting the middle part and now I'll just take my scissors and I'll cut some tiny parts over here as you can see. After doing that, I'll apply some white glue over here and then I'll just use my paintbrush to spread it out evenly. And after that, as you can see, when the glue is nice and spread, now you can just pick it up and start gluing these two sides together on both of the sides so that you get a nice and neat effect over here as you can see now my frame is ready so now to decorate it what I'm gonna do is that I'll take this white foam sheet stripe and I'll just stick it over here on the corners So I'll just keep it a little slanting and then I'll just turn it from the side and go all the way through and once I'm done with the inner part then I'll just do it on the outer one as well. Okay, so now once this is done as you can see, now let's start decorating the frame. So for that I've taken this cardboard and I'll just take this beautiful dark maroonish color velvet fabric on top of this. So before that I'll just use my brush and I'll spread out the glue. So once the glue is nice and spread it, now I'll just take this beautiful colored velvet fabric you can go for any other colored fabric it's totally your choice now I'll just take this on top of this so once it's nice and dry I'll just use my pencil and I'll make some flowers over here Now after making the flower, I'll just cut it out and this way it will look like this. Now I'll just take my pencil and I'll fold the petals over here. And then this way I'll just make it a little puffier. And once this is done, this is what my flowers looks right now. So I've made quite a few more with different fabrics and laces so you can do that as well. It's very easy or you can use some artificial flowers and leaves as well. That's totally your choice. Now I'll just take this cardboard over this beautiful green colored fabric and I'll make some leaves over here. Then again same way I'll just fold them. So now as you can see these are all my handmade flowers and all. Now I'll just take this beautiful lace and I'll cut this flower out of that lace. You can also use any designer or any kind of fabric if you want. Then these are some golden glitter leaves. So it's a glitter fabric and now what I'll do is that I'll start sticking these flowers to my frame.
and in the middle you can use some more flowers or some gems for the rod so these are the lacy flowers which I made and this is the lace fab so now I'll cut these two flowers from the middle and then stick them outwards now for the leaves as well I'll just go on sticking them Okay, so once that is done, now in the middle, I'll apply these beautiful golden embellishments. Now I'll go with these golden leaves. So once this side of the design is completed, now I'll just repeat it on the other side as well. So once that is done, this is a beautiful golden rose gold piece I created. And it's just some acrylic golden dust with some glue and water. And it's very easy, you can just apply it on the white foam sheet over here. Just to give that beautiful golden highlight. So tada this is done now let's make the back side of this so again I'll take my photo and I'll just use the pencil to give some lines over here then I'll just take these thick cardboard pieces now I'll take this beautiful white cardboard and I'll stick it over here on these pieces so now once that is done let's make the stand so again I'm taking white cardboard and I'll stick over here so once the stand is ready as you can see this is how my photo frame turned out and now I'll just put the picture so guys this was it this was the final video of my photo frame and this was also some other kind of design which I created and I'm telling you guys that I'll be making more photo frames in future so you can just stay tuned for that and if you like this video make sure you give it a big fat thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and make sure you hit the bell icon so that whenever I post a new video you will be notified till next time bye bye